and pheromones The conversation flows Hello beautiful people and welcome to another video with your girl Siobhan. Thank you so much for clicking on the video and joining me today for this spring clean and decorate. Today this video is going to be in collaboration with Courtney from Mama Makes It Happen. I am super excited for this collaboration. Courtney is an amazing wife and mother. She has six children. Her content is very similar to mine. If you like my content, you're definitely going to enjoy hers. Definitely go and check out her video after you watch this one and leave her a comment letting her know that I sent you over, guys. When I tell you she does an amazing job cleaning and taking care of her family and just being a great person in general, you're going to love Courtney. I'm telling you right now, you're going to love her. So again, definitely check her out. I love the way her home is decorated. I love the way she cleans. I'm a fan. I, I'm actually a fan. So definitely go and check her out. But we are doing this spring clean and decorate. And guys, I'm super excited for it. I love the colors. I love the brightness of it. It just makes me happy. The weather is changing. We just had daylight savings. So I'm feeling really, really good. And I hope that you guys are going to enjoy the video. If you are new to the channel, I hope that you will consider subscribing. If you're coming from Courtney's channel, welcome. And if you are a lifetime loyal, thank you guys for coming back. You know I love you so much. I love you to the moon and back. Now let's hop right into the video. Make some time for me and you get you over, treat you right. We vibe it like a uh high. -huh. Uh -huh. Make it rendezvous. Make some time for me and you get together, you and I. We vibe it like a uh high. -huh. Turn it up, turn it up on a higher level Turn it up, turn it up, we got 
make you think that I should calm down And that I'm overthinking everything about you And that we're good the way we are some of the Easter stuff that I pulled out and also I ran to two stores which I'll talk about in a second but a lot of this stuff I had from last year so when Ross opened back up after you know the panty I'm gonna call it happened Ross opened back up and all of their Easter stuff was one dollar so I picked up a few things from Ross and I just stored them downstairs so the first thing I picked up was this table runner as you can see right here 99 cent yes everything was 99 cent from Ross I picked up these Easter eggs from Walmart I think these were 199 198 okay this set of towels I got from Ross as well they were 99 cents so you'll see the running theme a lot of this I know it looks like a lot but the majority of this stuff was 99 cents and that's why I picked it up also, last year I decorated for Easter and about 95% of my stuff came from Dollar General, Dollar Tree. If not more, that if not all of it came from Dollar Tree, but all of my stuff from last year, I only have like maybe four pieces from last year. So this is what I have. So again, I bought this, um, these tea towels, super cute. I love the tie dye guys and 99 cents. You get what? Two towels. So pretty good i bought this easter this a garland from walmart it was 9.98 i picked this up from hobby lobby you are egg extra special and everything all of their easter decor was what 40 percent off 5.99 40 percent off of that so let's put you right here i picked up this little lamb happy easter you know I love my snow globes. I love that. It was 40% off. I picked this stuff up from Walmart. Just some icing, you know, decorating because the kids and I are going to make some Easter treats. So I just bought a couple different icings and I bought purple. Oh, so I'm trying to, there's, there's a couple of them. So I bought five bags. That way when one is using one, they can kind of pass it on. That way no one feels like they don't have something orange green pink and of course you need white right so like i said i bought five of those and then i just bought some sprinkles we have spring sprinkles some green ones and then we have these ones so pick that all up from walmart with the little eggs and the little what is it called with the little eggs and the uh the garland Anyway, I picked up this little tray right here. 
with the bunny from Ross. It was 99 cent ceramic tray. Super cute. I'm showing you from this angle. Really cute. I picked this up from Hobby Lobby. I need to go get my nails done. I just haven't prioritized that. This was $4.99, but it was 40% off. So I picked that up. I thought that was just super cute. I don't know. The girl with the... I just think it's cute. This can be all year round. It's just, it's really cute. Anyway, I know I say cute a lot. We're going to move past that. So from Hobby Lobby, I picked up these candy wafers, yellow, just so again, we can melt those down, do a little baking with that. These are some Easter egg. No, sorry, guys. I'm looking at the sign. These are Easter carrots, guys. And you get three in a pack for $5.99, 40% off. This little tray I had for a while, I think it was just with my Easter decor, yeah. Got that from Target for $5. That was probably in the Target dollar spot. Um, I got this sign from Hobby Lobby. It's not about the bunny, it's about the lamb. And it was so cute. And London absolutely loves this sign. So $6.99, 40% off. Just remember Hobby Lobby, 40% off of everything. And I didn't get too much from Hobby Lobby. I picked this up. From Hobby Lobby, $9.99, and it says, By this we know love, because Jesus Christ laid down his life for us. So, I just picked that up, and I can actually take this off to show you a little bit better. But there you go. And I picked these flowers up right here. They're super, the stem is super long, guys. Hold on. I'll try and do it this way. But the stem is super long. It's going to go on my black face. These yellow flowers, I got these from, they're so soft too. I got these from Marshalls. They were $4.99 for a three stem. And they were only $4.99. I think they're really pretty. They look super, super real. Oh my goodness. So I got that from Marshalls. I got this little bunny right here. I've had this bunny for a little while. I can't remember where I got it. It's old. I've had it for a while, but I want to say I got it from Ross. I don't see the tag on it, but I do remember having it last year. So then we have this bunny right here. Happy Easter and 99 cent. This one right here with the carrots, 99 cent. These two back here, 99 cent. These two right here, both 99 cent from Ross. I picked this up from hold on, from Hobby Lobby, this little Easter sign. I'm hoping it fits on my tier tray, $7.99. And then I picked up these little beads, and these were $9.99. Anything with the spring shop was 40% off. So I'll just sit those right there. I know the pinks are a little different, but that's okay because... It's just like a little rainbow effect of pink in here. So I picked this up from, I got this from Ross, right? Yes, 99 cent, 99 cent. This is old, which I probably will be getting rid of. Look at that, it's beat up. But this is like the Dollar Tree stuff that I had. So I had this from last year. I had these flowers. I had those two boards. And you can look back at my uh 2020 easter decorate with me and see i really didn't have much it was before i painted my mantle and everything so <laughs> i picked this up from hobby lobby 7.99 and i'm just gonna stick it over here so you can see it says praise the lord and then i got that bunny from ross it's a wood bunny you can see the wood in it i picked this up from hobby lobby there's one of the stems um, or one of the picks, and that was 40% off. See how it has spring pack. I bought a couple different picks to kind of do as filler for my um, tier tray. I bought this yellow vase from Hobby Lobby, $9.99, part of the spring shop. I wanted to bring in some more yellow because once Easter is done, I'm still going to keep a lot of the yellow if not all of the yellow for moving into summer. So I found this little frame. It's coming off really bright. It's not that bright. Here, let me move it over here. But 
I found that frame at Hobby Lobby. It was $2.49. And I just like the yellow. Like I said, I was trying to find some yellow. Then I picked up a few more things from Hobby Lobby. I got these little, so I got the bunny. I got the bunny. Wait, these are both bunnies. Duh. Oh my goodness. They're just so cute. I just noticed that. I'm not even gonna lie. <laughs> not even gonna lie. So anyway, these were $5.99. And they were 40% off. So I got two of those. The twins really like these. They're just super cute, right? And then I got this. It says, Happy Easter, y'all. This was $9.99. And then I got this bunny. The ears you can kind of, sorry guys, you can kind of adjust. And this was $3.99. Yes, babe? Can I go outside on the front porch? I also got these carrots from Hobby Lobby. $6.99. I got this basket. This basket was $4.99. And it's part of the spring shop too. So this was on sale too, but it's just another piece of decor. I'm not really sure how I'm going to use it yet, but I picked it up. And then I saw these. You're a diamond. Nothing can break you. And it was $4.99. Part of the spring decor. No bunny loves you like Jesus. London loves this one too. $1.99. And God bless this hot mess, which I thought was just cute for a tear tray. Spring decor, $4.99. These are part of the spring decor as well. $6.99. Both of these, like I said, these were $6.99 and 40% off. And they're just great to put a candle on. I, like you can use these all year round and decorate them. So I picked those up. I had this from last year. I think I got that from Dollar Tree. I can't remember. It's like little garland. Um, then I got this napkin ring. No, no, napkin holder. $9.99. It was part of the spring shop, 40% off, but it's marble and gold. I'm gonna keep this on my dining room table or somewhere in my dining room all year round. I think it's just really um, it goes with my aesthetic and I can add napkins to it. I just picked these up because these are Easter related. These are 98 cent. I got them from Walmart, but I can just put regular napkins in here for the, the kids to grab when they are eating, you know, but I really did like this and I was so glad I found that. I had this from last year and then I got these little pick things from the Dollar Tree. I just stuck them in there. They weren't decorated like that but I stuck them in there for storing, I think. I can't remember. Anyway, I got this from Ross, 99 cents. Again, I got this one with the marble. I got those two from Ross. I don't know where I got this from. Yeah, I had that for a minute. I got these two Easter signs, guys, 99 cent. 99 cent. 99 cent for this one as well. I couldn't pass it up. So I think I spent maybe in between 12 to $15 at Ross last year on just Easter stuff. I know it looks like a lot, but I really didn't spend too much. Those two gold planters right there, I got from Marshall's. They were $9.99 a piece. Those are just going to be for my plants that are in the living room. I wanted to get something to kind of lift them up. So I'm trying that again. So it's not Easter decor, it's just something, you know. And then this is the rest of the stuff that I have over here. I did get a sign over here from Hobby Lobby. And let me show you. It says, he is not here for he has risen, as he said in Matthew 20, 28, 6. So of course it has like the stone is moved. I think that's really nice. This was, yes, baby. $15.99. It was 40% off. I'm going to put that in the kitchen. I wanted to have something above my stove. So I like so that. again, this is everything that I have. Not saying I'm going to use all of it. I don't know, but I'm going to get to decorating and then I'm going to vacuum in the dining room one more time since bringing all this stuff up and in. So let's get to A different side of me. Yeah. Now I am starting to decorate and guys, after I got done decorating, I was actually a little sad because I'm like, oh, I can only leave this up for about two weeks or so, you know. I don't know. I was loving the decorations, guys. And I don't feel like I overdid it at all. And the best thing about it 
Let me tell you right now, the best thing about it is that I bought the majority of this stuff last year and it was a dollar. It was one dollar and I love the quality of it. I love the style. So I'm super excited about it. So I didn't spend a lot of money on this at all, but it looks like I did. So I'm excited. So anyway, like I was saying, I was starting to decorate and I just was like, oh, I can only leave it up for this little bit of time, but we're going to make it work. We're going to make it work. The kids love the way that it is decorated. They just love it. They love it. And I'm super excited for that. That makes me so happy. Just to let you know, whenever you're decorating, you can play around with it. You don't have to, you know, commit to something the first time you try it. <laughs> As you can see, you play around with it. You see where you like it. If you don't, you can leave it up for a day or so and then take it down. It just depends. But like I said, you can play around. You don't have to commit to anything at all. Just just go with the flow. See how it feels for you. <music> The one I'd like to be A different side of me, yeah I did actually play around with this shelf over here a little bit, guys. I just, I, honestly, I love the way that the shelf looks, so I don't change it up too much. I just maybe change up a few pieces here and there, depending on what I'm decorating for, and I go with it, you know, I just go with it. But I didn't do too much. I like how, I guess it's kind of simple, and it definitely looks like I had a lot of decor on the dining room table. Yes, I definitely get that. But I did decorate the living room, the dining room, and a little bit of the kitchen. So it kind of all worked out. And I decorated two tier trays. There's a hunger in my soul Makes me keep on trying Holding on, take me on I'm looking for a brand new start I know I got some trouble getting over you I think that I've played my part I need to get away somewhere far from you I'ma buy, I'ma buy plane ticket Run away by myself for a minute
Now that the living room is done, I'm going to be moving into the dining room. And that was pretty much done as well. I just had to vacuum a little bit. But like I said, I love the way everything turned out with the mantle and the shelving units. And yeah, even the table, like it's very simple, but it makes a statement. You can tell that it is spring, guys. So I'm loving it. I might buy one more thing or maybe from the Dollar Tree just to put on that white wreath that's hanging on the door. Other than that, I am done. I don't need anything else for for Easter, spring. So I'm feeling pretty good about it. I, I really love it. I love the yellow. The, the yellow is just so pretty. It's so pretty and so bright. So moving into the dining room, the dining room, I was going to do some placemats and everything, but we use the table so frequently. I did not want to put all of that on there because I would just have to right, remove it. So now I'm moving into the dining room, guys. And like I said, I kept it very simple, but I didn't want to, because I didn't want to do too much. I didn't want to overwhelm the space at all because we use the dining room so frequently. We use it for virtual learning, for eating, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. But I will say that my favorite part of the dining room are the tear trays and the bunnies on the hutch, guys. Like, I'm loving it. I am so loving every bit of it. <laughs> I love the colors, like I said. And when I tell you the girls love the little bunnies on the tear trays, they love them. <laughs> so I think it looks really good. It looks spring, Easter, but also simple too. Like it's not too much at all. So I love it. I hope you love it too. And my heart's been fast when it's looking like that. Oh, smile is killing me. It's the way that it moves and the way that it laughs So I can't get enough Think about him all the time I can get him off my mind Oh, I want him to be mine, to be mine My heart is saying yeah, 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 yeah You know I want him now, 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 now My heart is saying yeah, 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 yeah Yeah, yeah, yeah I told him I can be a fighter if you want I'll be there to catch you if you fall Yeah, 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 yeah
Yeah. I told him I can be a fighter if you want. I'll be there to catch you if you fall. I can make it brighter when it's dark. When it's dark. I told him I would do it all for you, and I know you do it for me too. I can be a fighter if you want. If you want. I can be a fighter. I can be a fighter. Now we couldn't do a video without some suds, right? We couldn't do a video without washing dishes. No, <laughs> I definitely had to include some dishwashing in this video, but nonetheless, I was cleaning up the kitchen and I just wanted to do a little bit of decorating in here. I didn't do too much at all, but I did put some stuff up above my cabinets as well as the dish towels and the girls and I, the kids and I were going to be making some Easter treats. So that is about it for the kitchen. And I think that's perfect because my kitchen isn't the biggest kitchen in the world. So it doesn't need a lot of decorations. And I didn't feel like I needed to go out and buy a lot of stuff for the kitchen. So as I'm cleaning up, I'm also making dinner. <laughs> I made some what did I make actually? Some thighs and then I made some mashed potatoes and some cauliflower and broccoli. Super simple. I know you can't tell, but in the video guys, doing this video, I was super sick this day. I was back and forth. I, I just did not feel good at all. That's the best way I can put it. I was throwing up. I was taking my breaks. Then I would lay down for a moment. Then I would get back up and do a little bit more. Then I would be sick again. Oh my gosh, guys. Yes. <laughs> so I was struggling. I was, I was struggling to get this video done, but I love the way that it turned out. I hope you enjoyed watching it, guys. And I appreciate you all so very much. So very much. I'm so thankful, so appreciative of you all. Believe me when I tell you that. So I'm going to wrap up cleaning up the kitchen and yeah, do my final reveal for you. So much, but I'm finding games When I'm at the top, I just wanna play If you are looking for one hell of a ride Just come and get it, baby, I'm all yours Come and get it, come and get it Come and get it, come and get it Come and get it, come and get it If you are looking for one hell of a ride Just come and get it, baby, I'm all yours Come on, come on. 
So thank you so much, beautiful people, for watching. I really hope you enjoyed the video. I hope that it gave you some motivation or some inspiration to clean and decorate. And I love you guys to the moon and back. Like I said, I kept my kitchen very simple, nothing too extravagant. I just wanted to have that pop of spring, the colors, as well as represent Easter. And yes, I hope you hope you enjoyed it. Have a marvelous day, and I will talk to you in the next video. Bye. Without thinking, no.